Long, long ago, when the world was still flat, back before humans knew of magic, in the very center of the ocean floated a tiny yet beautiful island. Its name was Illusia. In those days, on the continent of Fadiel, five great countries flourished. Jad, land of sand. Topol, land of water. Wendel, land of green. Ish, land of fire. And Lorimar, land of ice. All in Fadiel believed the isle was holy, protected by a guardian beast. No one dared to set foot there. On the island, there stood one indescribably enormous tree. The tree had been there before the world began. In fact, it was said to be the mother of every living thing in the world. But in those days, an ancient curse had gradually turned the tree to stone. For a long time, it remained asleep, seeming to some as if it were dead. Now then, I suppose I should tell you the story of how it all began. Of how a certain young man came to possess a sacred sword. And how a certain young maiden became a goddess of mana. It's a winding tale of hope and despair, connecting the worlds of humans and of my fellow spirits. Bougie! is worried. Oh, you're going to need a leash, Bougie. Hey, remember, Kelby? Maybe it's <laughs> spirit. <laughs> but why? And to your soul. Ritzia. I believe in you. Let's go! You must Run go away. there for help. Such is your destiny. Kelby! Forward! March! We're counting on you. You may commence firing. Fire! I won't let you! The Guardian Beast? What now? This is now! I mean, Keldrick is dead. <laughs> 